This is the lunge. This is the sneak attack. And this is what scientists at Caltech call tussling. These are male flies, which are much more aggressive than females. The scientists were recording these battles as they were trying to figure out what it is about males, in particular, what it is in their brains that makes them more aggressive than the female flies. They used a whole range of tools from genetics and neuroscience, and here's what they found. Male flies have several neurons that females don't. And when one gene on those neurons is tweaked to make it produce more of a substance called tachykinin, the flies get more violent. The degree of control that the scientists had was extraordinary. By fiddling with one gene on only three neurons, they could ramp up or tone down the level of aggression in male flies. What makes this even more interesting is that the same gene and the same chemical are found in mammals like mice and people. In them, it's called substance P, and substance P is also tied to aggression. People aren't flies. But we have more in common than you might think. It seems that the evolutionary roots of human behavior run very deep.